good morning it is monday welcome back to another weekly vlog i got up around an hour ago and got ready and then i noticed this camera was dead and i searched high and low for the charger and i just can't find it anywhere so i can't believe i've already lost it i've only owned this camera for a few weeks thankfully i had a charger from another device that i could charge this with so it all worked out this is what i'm wearing today nothing too exciting i have on this blue turtleneck from Maritzia. I have this in white as well and I wear them both all the time. They're really comfortable. And then my Everlane leggings that I just rave about. I love these. I'll link them below if anyone wants them. And then some socks with polar bears on them. So that's the look. I'm in my kitchen now because I'm going to make some chai before I start working, but I wanted to show you how much it snowed. Oh my goodness. It's so cold. Look at this. There's something so nice about being in your kitchen in the morning and just having the outdoors be covered in snow. I don't know, I just love it. This is the chai that I use. It is spiced chai at black tea concentrate from Trader Joe's. Because it's a concentrate, you don't need a lot of it. So I use about one part concentrate to two parts non-dairy milk. Now I'm using macadamia nut milk. All done, let's see what it tastes like. So good, I could drink chai or matcha all day. Coffee is something that I only drink like once or twice a week. I like it, but it's just not something that I want every day, but I could drink these every day. <laughs> it's 8.10 right now, and I'm going to go log on for the day, so I'll see you later. Hello, I'm just working at my desk right now again. It's so nice finally having one. I do need to get um, a different chair like I mentioned because I'm on this like lounge chair but I do have a cute desk chair in my office that a furniture rep I work with gave to me. I think there was like some little thing wrong with it, so they were getting rid of them, and it's really cute. It's like a baby blue color, so I think I'm gonna try to go get that from my office this week, and then I'll have to find another spot for this chair, but this one works for now. It's 12.30 already. I cannot believe how fast the days go by. Oh my goodness. I'm listening to this playlist on Spotify right now. It's called Morning Coffee. I really like having music in the background when I work, if it's like calming and relaxing, sometimes instrumental music. So I'm listening to this one right now and it's just perfect for a Monday. <laughs> okay, I'm going to make some lunch. I'm going to make some sweet potato bowls with quinoa, black beans, corn, sweet potatoes, and tomatoes. I have to heat everything on my stove because my microwave has been broken for months. <laughs> We've had someone come look at it a couple times and try to fix it, but it just isn't working. So my landlord is just going to order us a new one, but it's not here yet. So the stove it is. I accidentally burnt them. <laughs> now I'm adding this sauce that I made yesterday. I make this all the time for grain bowls and burrito bowls and stuff. It's just half a cup of cashews, soaked preferably, but I didn't have time and sometimes I'm just too impatient. So I didn't soak mine. I just had to blend it for longer. I think I used like a third of a cup to a half a cup of water, somewhere around there, and then the juice of one lime, but you can totally adjust those measurements. It's all just preference. There it is. I'm going to go eat this and get back to work. I just finished working and came out to my living room to work out, but I have the sudden overwhelming urge to rearrange my living room furniture. So it's probably part procrastination to work out, but also that's just who I am. <laughs> I rearrange things all the time. This is only like this because we move it like this when we have a Christmas tree and it's been nice to have a change for the last couple months, but it's time to move it back. I 
just showered after I worked out and now I'm watching The Bachelor. I also just ate dinner. Um, I don't know if I showed the living room after I finished rearranging it. I also just sliced my toe open on <laughs> the bottom of my trash can. I don't even know how I did that, but I'm like so accident prone. This stuff happens to me all the time. Okay. There it is. I filmed a what I eat in a day video today for my TikTok. So I'm going to edit that while I watch this and then I'm going to go to bed. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Hello, it's a new day now. It's actually 2.15 on Tuesday. I've just been working all day, so I haven't had a chance to pick up my camera. So I'm just now getting on here to say hello. I was planning on going into my office today because there's a couple of physical samples that were delivered that I have to go approve, but it's snowing again. And one, I have not cleaned off my car, and two, my car just cannot function in any snow. It is really bad in the snow. So I think I'm going to go tomorrow instead. I mentioned last night that I cut my foot open on <laughs> my trash can, which is just gross and embarrassing. Why is this even a topic of discussion on my vlog? <laughs> but yeah, I cut my toe open on my trash can. Don't ask me how it happened, I don't know. But it really hurts so bad still. And I just like came and put shoes on. So that's another reason why I'm not going into my office today because I can't go in barefoot. <laughs> I braided my hair this morning. I love braiding my hair, but it just, takes a while so I don't do it super often but I did it this morning I'm wearing this tank top from free people and some sweats and Christmas socks <laughs> I'm going to get back to work now but I just wanted to come on here and say hello happy Tuesday and I'll see you later hello it is a little after 5 30 now I just logged off for the day and finished working. I usually like to take, if I can, a little break around like 5.30 or 6 after I finish work work for the day before I start working on um, brand deals and all that type of stuff for the rest of the night. So sometimes I'll work out, do yoga, cook, relax, yada yada. Today I've decided I wanna make cookies during this time, so. That's what we're gonna do. I think I'm gonna make peanut butter cookies. I have changed since the last clip. I'm in a full brown outfit. <laughs> my hair, my shirt, my leggings, they're all the same color. I don't know, I'm into this color lately. But I still have <laughs> my Christmas socks on, don't you worry. I think I'm also going to go live on TikTok while I do this, so here we go. Okay, I'm preheating the oven. It's preheating to 350. I don't have a lot of flour left. Baking soda. I'm using half a teaspoon of that and a half a teaspoon of baking powder. Okay, what's next? Salt? Now I'm doing brown sugar. I only have half a cup of peanut butter, but I was making this recipe as if I had a full cup. So now I've already poured all the dry ingredients in here and now I need to only use half of them. Oh man. Again, guys, I'm not following a recipe. I'm just, I'm just doing it. I thought this is gonna go really well. <laughs> I don't even know like what the consistency of peanut butter cookies is supposed to be like. This is really ambitious of me to make something that I have no idea how to make. I think I'm just gonna bake these and hope for the best. Good morning guys, it is Wednesday now. I don't think I finished vlogging anything last night, but I did make peanut butter cookies. I just ate one of them for breakfast, so <laughs> we're starting off the day strong. Um, and now I'm just making some chai. I'm not in the mood to make breakfast, so I'm eating another cookie. <laughs> it's nice and sunny out today, as you can see. I hope that means that some of the snow is melting because I do have to go clean off my car finally because I have to go into my office soon to go review a couple things. So I'm gonna need to go clean off my car soon, but I'm dreading it. I'm in my car right now because I have to go into my office now. Um, and then I also have to drop something off at UPS on the way back. And I just spent so long shoveling my car out. I really hope that when I come back, 
someone's not in it. That's like the saddest thing ever when you um, have to park on the street and you spend so long shoveling your car out and then you come back and someone's taken it. It's like so sad. Okay, where did I last leave this? I think I was going to my office in the last clip, which was much earlier in the day. It's now 5.30. Um, I just finished work for the day. I went to my office for a few hours to review and approve a couple things. Stopped at UPS on the way back to drop off a package and then I worked at home the rest of the day. Now it's 5.30, I just finished working and I'm going to make dinner. So I figured you could make it with me. My stove is noisy. It makes that sound while it's heating up. <laughs> I'm going to make some pasta. I don't have a lot left of this, but I'm just gonna use it up. It's gluten-free pasta made with green lentils, kale, broccoli, and spinach. In a pan, I am heating up some oil. I'm going to add some broccoli and mushrooms that I already cooked a few days ago, some tofu, and some tomatoes. Now I'm going to add the broccoli and mushrooms to this pan with the rest of this tofu. I'm going to use this pesto as the sauce from Trader Joe's, but I don't have a lot left, so I'm going to blend up some cashews and water with maybe some salt and lemon juice um, just to make like a creamy cashew sauce. It doesn't have much flavor, but I'm just gonna mix it to this to make it creamy and add some more to it. Again, I'm not soaking these because I wasn't planning on using them tonight, but I'm adding this pesto to the vegetables and tofu. And then I'm adding the cashew sauce. I'm adding some spinach now and letting that cook down while I drain my pasta. I'm also adding some uncooked tomatoes on top. I'm going to watch some Grey's Anatomy while I eat this and edit a brand deal for TikTok that I've been working on. I've been binge watching Grey's Anatomy for the last like three months. I used to watch it all the time and then I stopped a few years ago, but I've been trying to catch up again the last few months. I'm on season 16. So if you guys watch it too, let me know what season you're on. I've just been getting some stuff done on my laptop and watching Grey's since that last clip. It's 9.30 now. So I'm getting a bit tired. I will probably get ready for bed in a minute. I just ordered my next month of Newly. Um, it's a subscription-based clothing website if you guys haven't heard of it, but I'm so excited. I think the items should probably be here in a few days, so I'll show you when they get here. I'll show you a little sneak peek of what I ordered. Got a jacket, some flared jeans, this midi dress, a top, a skirt and another jacket. So I'm excited for that to arrive. Also, you see that box over there? If you remember from my last vlog, I ordered a desk from Ikea and the day that it was supposed to arrive, it still hadn't shipped yet. And I ended up calling and speaking to someone there about it and she told me to just cancel it and go buy one in um, the closest store to me. So that's what I did, I canceled it that day so then a couple days after that i got a shipping confirmation and i called and i was like hi i canceled this order and the person i spoke to that time was basically like no it was never canceled sorry you're gonna have to just come and return it once you get it <laughs> so now i have to drive back to ikea oh man but i guess that gives me an opportunity to look around and see if i want to get anything else because i was kind of in a rush last time i was there so i'll probably go to ikea either friday night or saturday morning either way i'll bring you along with me maybe this time i'll be brave enough to record myself in the store no promises <laughs> i guess we'll see if it ends up in the rest of this vlog um Okay, I'm gonna go get ready for bed now. I just took my makeup off and washed my face and now I'm doing the rest of my skincare. I'm using this Paracone MD moisturizer and I'm going to mix it with the Isle of Paradise tanning drops again. Last time I used them, I forgot to wash my hands and I woke up with bright orange hands. So I'm going to remember this time. <laughs> I need to go change my shirt because I just realized I can't get it down my neck if I'm wearing a turtleneck. I'll be back. 
Okay, I put this sweatshirt on instead. I'm going to do four drops of this. Good to go. What's next? Oh my God, I almost forgot to wash my hands again. What's next is that we're washing our hands. Okay, I'm going to end today's vlog here. Good night. It's Thursday now. I got up a little while ago. I just put some laundry in. Now I'm going to do a quick ab workout. I'm not following anything on YouTube or anything. I'm just gonna make it up as I go. I have a little over an hour before I have to start working for the day. So I'm going to make this workout quick. And then I think I'm gonna clean up my apartment a bit. And then I'm going to get ready for the day. It's nice and sunny out today. I'm really appreciating the sun being out because it's been really gloomy the past couple weeks. And it puts me in kind of a sad mood. So I'm glad that it's nice and sunny out today. Even though it's cold. <laughs> just showered and got ready after I finished cleaning. Now I'm working and writing some stuff in my planner for the day. I'm also drinking some chai and I made some avocado toast that also has hummus and balsamic glaze on it. Good afternoon. It is four o'clock now. I've just been working since I last recorded anything. I did take a break in the middle of the day to eat lunch. I made my bed. I painted my nails because they were gross looking. I just got off of a call a little while ago. It didn't have anything to do with any of my projects, but we have a committee in my firm that focuses on progressing in terms of diversity, inclusivity, equity. So today we had Dr. Robert Livingston as a guest speaker. He is a lecturer of public policy at Harvard and his whole research focuses on social justice and diversity and I also ordered his recent book so I'm excited to get that and read that. Yeah, that's what I was doing for the last couple hours. I also just got a package in the mail a little while ago from Sephora. I have this um, hair perfume already but the bottle that I had just stopped working. I couldn't get any product out of it, so they sent me a replacement. This is it. If you haven't tried this, I recommend at least going into a Sephora and smelling it because it smells so good. I wear this every day in my hair. Good morning, happy Friday. I woke up a little while ago. I was gonna go on a run because I haven't been on one in a while and it looks really nice out, but apparently it's 12 degrees and it feels like negative two. So, Definitely not gonna do that. Um, I'm just gonna work out in my living room and make up a workout as I go. So that's what we're doing this morning. So oh, I just finished getting ready after working out this morning and now I'm making some chai, of course. I've been using this Milkadamia, unsweetened macadamia nut milk. That's a mouthful and it's really good. I always get a pump of vanilla in my chai lattes when I get them at a cafe. I need to get vanilla syrup or something so that I can do that at home. Because that's always the one thing that's missing. I'm making some toast for breakfast. This is the bread I'm using from Trader Joe's. It is organic super bread, whatever that means. And then I'm using this organic super fruit blend jam from Thrive. 
I have a lot of work to get done today, so it's gonna be a pretty busy day. I think I'm gonna go to my office in the middle of the day during my lunch break to finally grab my desk chair so that my back can stop hurting sitting at that lounge chair. I'm not sure how late I'll be working today, but if it's not too late, I might go to Ikea tonight. If not, I'll probably just go to Ikea in the morning. Hello, we are on the way to my office. Megan's here, she's driving. Um, we're taking her car because mine is puny and cannot fit anything. I can't fit my desk chair in it. So we're in her car. I'm trying to be trendy with my hair. Um, I got inspo from TikTok. I feel like I look like Xenon. If I, I hope people know who I'm talking about when I say that. <laughs> but that was like my favorite movie when I was younger. So I'm channeling my inner Xenon. I also just got some roses. We did a quick stop at Trader Joe's. So I bought some roses for myself. Happy Valentine's Day to me. I got the chair, it's back there. It's a lot bigger than I remember and my desk is really small, so I hope it's fine. I have the chair, guys. I finally have an office chair. Like I can't believe it took me, I don't even know how many months it's been since March to get an actual office set up in my apartment. So better late than never. <laughs> I had to move the, um, oh, my foot's asleep. That's like the worst feeling, stepping on a sleeping foot. <laughs> um, okay, so I had to move the lounge chair because it just could not fit in my bedroom. So I put the lounge chair there to make a little reading corner. It's five o'clock now. I have some more things I have to finish for work. I think I might also order dinner soon. I'll probably order Thai food to be honest, knowing me. I'm like insane. Every time I order takeout, it's Thai. I just don't get sick of it. I've also decided I'm gonna go to Ikea tomorrow and not tonight because I just don't think I'm gonna be able to fit it in. So I'm going to return that box in the morning, probably after I go to Trader Joe's because I like to go grocery shopping first thing. I might also look for some little decor pieces or something while I'm there because there's just some spots in our apartment that I feel like could use some things. So that's the plan for tomorrow, but the plan for tonight is to work and eat Thai food. <laughs> Good morning. It is finally the weekend. It's Saturday morning. I just went to Trader Joe's. I'll show you what I got. Starting off with the most obvious purchase, some chai concentrate. <laughs> I also got this coconut creamer I've never tried, some blueberry lavender almond milk, coconut milk, some sourdough. I mentioned in my last grocery haul that gluten does not make me feel great, so I try to avoid it, but here I am buying a loaf of bread again, so I can't resist. This rice cracker medley I used to get all the time in high school, and I haven't had it in a while, so I got this. I'm gonna make some salads this week, so I grabbed some kale, chickpeas, cucumbers, and avocados, got some cliff bars, some peanut butter. I'm also going to make some tahini pasta this week. So I got some gluten-free pasta, some tahini, some tomatoes and some basil, Dijon mustard. I love these dairy-free yogurts. So I got a couple of those. I also got some dark chocolate almonds. These are so good, I could just eat the whole thing. I think I'm going to make tofu scramble sometime this week. So I got some tofu, red pepper, and onion. And lastly, some lemons and limes because I just use these for a bunch of different things. That's it. I forgot that I also had my newly package delivered this morning. So I'll show you everything that I got in that and then I'm gonna go to Ikea. All right, these are the first two items and I am just immediately obsessed. These black jeans are so cute. They're cropped and a little bit flared on the bottom. And then I'm not really sure why I got this top, to be honest, considering it's freezing out, but this is one of the cutest tops I've ever seen. It ties on the sides. That's the back. I wish it was warmer so that I could <laughs> wear this without a jacket over it, but I will make an excuse to wear it. So cute, 10 out of 10. <laughs> the next item is this faux leather mini skirt, and I think it's cute, but it's a little noisy. Like if you can hear me moving around, um, I think maybe if I have tights on, that won't be a problem, but I think it's pretty cute. 
I also got this jacket, so I just threw it on with the same outfit. And I just think it's so cute. I don't have anything like this. I feel like with black tights and some Doc Martens, this could be such a cute outfit. Last item is this jacket. I just have such an obsession with jackets. I think I have showed you guys before, but this entire closet is just <laughs> a million jackets. But yeah, this is really cute. I like this one a lot. I think I've mentioned newly previously on one of my vlogs, but it is a like clothing rental subscription service you pay monthly. I've worked with them on some brand deals in the past. So I used to have a code for a discount off your first month, but I unfortunately don't have it anymore. But basically you get six items each month and then you can buy certain things if you wanna keep them at a discounted rate. So I'm thinking about maybe keeping this honestly and that cream ruffly top that I tried on first. So I might be keeping those. I really like these jeans too. So these might also be on my <laughs> list of possible things to keep. I didn't notice, but um, there's like a slit at the bottom too. Okay, I've decided that I wanna wear some of these pieces today. So I'm wearing these black jeans. I have my Doc Martens on. This gray sweater is called the Alessia sweater from Maritzia. I believe it's sold out right now, but hopefully it comes back in stock soon. And then this jacket. I'll link the Newly website below. This video was not sponsored by them. I just figured I would link it if anyone's interested. I'll also see if I can find links to these pieces um, on websites where you can actually purchase them and not just rent them. So if I can find any links to them, I'll put those below as well. I'm gonna go to Ikea now, so I'll bring you along with me. My mask always stuck on my earrings. <laughs> I went to Target after I went to Ikea and then I just grabbed a chai latte and now I'm gonna head back home. So when I get home, I will show you what I got. Hello, I just got home. I'll show you what I got. Megan's here. <laughs> I literally always take any opportunity to show her so that people don't think I spend all my days alone. Um, I got two red wine glasses. I got two white ones last time I went. I need some for red wine as well. Also got this vase. Didn't need it, but I wanted it. What else? I also got some drawer organizers for my like sock drawer and stuff because it's just a chaotic mess. So... Now it'll be organized. That's everything I got from Ikea. And then I just got a few like food items from Target that I couldn't get at Trader Joe's. And that's everything I got. I'm gonna go make some lunch now. It's much later now. I've just been editing this vlog most of the day and getting some other stuff done since I got back from the store earlier. And now my friend Britt is on her way over, so I'm going to end this vlog here. This video will be up tomorrow, which is Sunday, and then my apartment tour video, finally, it will be up probably a few days after that. I'm not sure exactly what day yet, but it'll be someday that week. So look out for that if you guys wanna watch it. Don't forget to subscribe and follow my Instagram and TikTok if you guys wanna keep up with me there. I hope you guys enjoyed watching and I hope you have a good week. I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.